Hi all, Professor Ayub Matthew here. Today we are going to discuss about the career opportunities of doing a course in construction management. In this session, we are going to discuss about basically what is construction management, what is the scope of construction management in India as well as abroad, what are the skill sets needed to land up in this job, the average salary, what course you have to learn and where you have to get trained. Basically, construction project management or construction management is an overall planning as well as coordination and control of a project from beginning to its completion. It is directly at meeting a client's requirements to produce a functionality and economically viable project. In construction management, a construction manager will supervise and manage contractors, laborers and uh, allied vendors at the construction sites. From time to time, they meet and discuss projects with the uh, architects or specialized trade employees or civil engineers that is employed on field or even they need to interact with the lenders that may be uh, banks or NBFCs whatever it is or some other investors to negotiate it so, though that's not that much common but that also sometimes as a construction manager you have to do apart from that a construction manager is responsible for addressing emergencies or work delays or any other problems that affect the construction project the question is whether is it worthy to opt a career as a construction manager mckinsey research shows that the demand for construction managers will grow to 11 percentage by 2025 in spite of the COVID situations and various HR consultancies have conducted a few surveys regarding the job satisfaction of construction managers and uh, it's obviously came out uh, uh, with uh, satisfactory numbers like uh, 75 percentage of the construction managers are happy with the job profile. There are various uh, academic programs offered in the specialization of construction management. Basically, these programs are aimed at learning and developing skills required for construction management. Some universities are offering BSc in construction management. Some are offering BBA in construction management or in the PG levels, MTech or MBA in construction management. And a few other institutions, they are offering diploma and postgraduate diploma in construction management that's even uh, sometimes recognized by some foreign accreditation agencies but it's very evident that after completing a civil engineering or a BARC you can pursue this job even without an additional qualification but after completing a BTEC or BARC if you do a PG program or MBA or a PG diploma program in construction management Obviously, that will add value to your resume as well as that will enhance your scope to get placed in some companies abroad as construction manager. Some companies doesn't mean that you will be obviously placed in uh, Middle East companies, but uh, you can obviously try there in Malaysia, Singapore or even North America and Europe. Options are many. BSc programs in construction management, uh, generally the fee uh, varies anywhere from uh, 50,000 to 1 lakh rupees per semester in a decent college. And uh, when it comes to BTEC programs, obviously you know the fee varies from uh, even from 10,000 rupees to 5 lakh rupees based on the quality of the institution. Diploma as well as PG diploma that's usually conducted in as a one year program and the fee structure may be something uh, anywhere near to 2 lakh rupees. Next, let's have a look on what are the job profiles that suits for a construction manager? You need not think that you will be hired explicitly with the name as construction manager. In spite of that, sometimes you will be hired as a facilities manager or a construction coordinator or a sustainability consultant or even as an estate manager. When it comes to the question who are the top recruiters, obviously all the construction companies, they will recruit construction managers. ILNFS or Reliance Infra, Divan Housing, GMR, JP, Hindustan Construction, Simplex, LNT, IRB Infra, uh, the list is many. Even the real estate or construction companies that near to your neighborhood, 
they may also prefer you next comes the important thing that's what will be the average salary obviously at the entry level you need not expect a bigger salary there in india because of the abundance of candidates in this particular sector at the entry level obviously you will get uh, anywhere uh, from 4 to 5 lakh rupees per annum and uh, since the sector is very much robust you can expect your salary will be increasing at a faster pace next let's have a look on what are the popular institutes offering construction management courses coep uh, pune they are offering uh, mtech in construction management and uh, the requirement to get into this program is you should have a valid gate score and based on the gate score the selection process takes place 2020 fee structure that comes almost uh, 2.2 lakhs for the entire program and uh, the second one is iit almost all the iits they have uh, the pg program called amtech in building technology and construction management or amtech in construction management or msc in construction management any of these programs are running the only requirement to get into these programs is a gate as well as uh, an engineering graduation in civil engineering or town planning or in some cases if that's amtech in construction management some universities as well as some IITs, they select candidate with B.Tech in Mechanical Engineering. Apart from that, the institutions like uh, lovely professional university Punjab and VJT Mumbai, Kumaraguru College of Technology, Coimbatore, Satyabhama University, Hindusan University, Integral University, Lucknow, Amity University, Mumbai, MIT College of uh, Management, Pune, etc etc many other if you want to know the entire list of these that i have given in the description you can check it the bottom line is obviously if you are a civil engineer this will be the apt job for you personally i prefer you never go for a graduation that means a bba or bsc in construction management to pursue this career instead of that you choose the engineering career in civil engineering and do some MBA or MTech program in construction management. That will add value to your resume. As well as a diversified job sector will be opening in front of you as days go by. As well as you move up the ladder and increases your experience. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching. See you in another episode. Till then, bye from Anup. Please subscribe and click on the bell icon for more videos.